Thanks to Wondrium for sponsoring this video. Dancing every day for a video that will go on YouTube where everybody's going to see me dancing? Yeah. <laughs> <sighs> Hello, welcome to our dancing journey. That couple at the beginning there, that's Jack Conti and Natalie Dawn. You may know them as Pomplamoose. Jack Conti is the founder of Patreon. And most importantly, they joined us on our video for walking 10,000 steps every day and quitting coffee for a month. They're joining on this dancing journey. So at first, we all sat down to discuss the ins and outs. Hello. Hi. Wait, are we supposed to be filming this? Well, yeah. we're gonna film it. <laughs> Well, after a bit of initial confusion and a sandwich. Waiting for a sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of sandwich are you getting? It's a pastrami sandwich on sourdough. Okay. Amazing. Okay, well, enjoy, and we'll see you in like 10 or 15. Yeah, yeah this is going to go in the final video. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, round two. <laughs> yeah. So first we discussed the rules of this dancing thing, like how long do we dance each time? I was thinking 20 minutes. That's yeah. legit. I'll be sweating yeah. in 20 minutes. I think we should shoot for 20, but if you can't get there, that's fine. Now, yeah. are there any yeah. rules about like the kind of dancing? Yeah, I right. think only ballroom dance. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna suggest only flossing for 20 minutes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Ready? Yeah. Yeah. This is oh, with yeah. no music. <laughs> My favorite thing about flossing that's is- That's exhausting. That's my second favorite thing about flossing. My first favorite thing about flossing is- You look like you're eight years old. Anyway, no, we're not saying you have to do any type of specific dancing. You just set a time and you dance. Could be slow dance, could be fast dance, could be flash dance. It won't be flash dance, but just dancing for a time because the point of this is to feel good. Look at what just happened to me. Like suddenly I'm full of endorphins and I'm excited and like energized and happy. That's why I was so excited about dancing. I was like, oh man, I'm gonna start every morning just feeling like a million bucks. If I'm sitting around the house, I'm like, I'm bored. I want to watch TV, play a video game. Dancing for no reason never comes to my mind. I want that to be something that comes to my mind. I want to see if that makes me feel good, you know? When you asked me about this, I was like, okay, so this is my chance to like practice dance moves. Definitely try to look cool. No, you're going to look dumb. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah, the point. That's yeah. the point. Like, even though I know that I'm going to look dumb. I'm going to try to look cool. And while it's happening, I'm gonna think that I look cool. And I'm gonna give you signals yeah. with my face and body language that indicate that you are in fact cool. Which is just gonna up the ante. <laughs> yeah, 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 exactly. Right. That. <laughs> My mind is always focused on like the practical. I have a tendency to not prioritize fun with you. So it'll be good for me to let go of the to-do list. I, my hope is that we will continue to do it after this and my suspicion is that we won't. <laughs> okay, so let's get going. First, by trying to work my marathon training into every conversation as usual. I'm concurrently doing a marathon training and I ran seven miles today and did a workout. I spent like six hours cooking. Point is, we're tired. I'm so tired. Dancing. <laughs> Are you tired too? Yeah, I'm tired, so I'm gonna go sleep right here. <laughs> okay. Okay, quick disclaimer. Most of the music you hear will not be the music we're dancing to, legal issues. But when I'm not listening to generic royalty-free music, I might hint at the music we're listening to through the magic of overdub. See if you can guess. Meow, 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 meow. This is my primary dance move. Yeah. <laughs> okay, that was 10 minutes. How do you feel? That's exhausting. That's hard work. I, mean, I feel good. I think I feel better. I, think I would on a normal day. I'm it was a very busy day. It was a busy day. The hard part this morning was waking up in a bad mood. I checked my phone before I got out of bed. I know I shouldn't do that. Got some emails. I was like, ah, oh, then I had to dance for 20 minutes. Didn't feel like doing it. Man, it's day two. I, I do feel better. Um, so it did, did kind of work again. <laughs> we just had dinner. Ooh, I can smell it again. I know, it was really good. <laughs> what was your yeah, Birdie can smell it. <laughs> She's like, what's for dinner? <laughs> what are we gonna do about dancing? What are we gonna listen to? I believe in a thing called love. Yeah. Just in a rhythm of my heart. I believe in a thing called love. Just in a rhythm of my heart. <laughs> Wait, I gotta do that high again. I missed it. I'm really <laughs> <laughs> Galileo! 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 Pause, I gotta make sure my nose ring is pointed the right way. I just don't want people to be like, oh, she's picking her nose. So far you've burped and picked your nose. 
What? I feel more energetic now than I did before we started. I, I was kind of tired. Before I was we, really tired yeah. before we started. And now I'm like, yes. The thing that motivates me to dance is singing. <laughs> Scream singing and jumpy stomping are things that you should leave out of your dancing routine in an apartment on an upper floor. Jumpy stomping was my nickname. Uh, Never. When I was in, in the Blue Man group. Anyway, Not Jumpy Stomper. I thought I was in Stomp, but they're like, no, no, you're in the Blue Man group. Stop stomping, Jumpy Stomping. <laughs> it's the second day, and I'm feeling pretty good about it. I've been having a really good day. Why don't you talk to me on a day where I've had, like, maybe not so good a day? Okay, I will wait to talk to you until you've had a bad day. Don't talk to me again. Our friends Rob and Tamara are here. Birdie, please dance. We're doing a thing here. Come on. I ran 14 miles today. I'm very tired. <laughs> That's crazy! <laughs> My legs hurt. <laughs> Dancing, we did it. How do you feel? Oh, <laughs> I feel great. I was pumped up. Yeah, well, it was happened pumped. and then it immediately left. Yeah. All of those animals, how do they feel? <laughs> Tamara, how do you feel? I'm sweaty. I shouldn't be this sweaty. <laughs> <laughs> it was 10 minutes of light dancing. <laughs> <laughs> I just said you shouldn't be that sweaty. <laughs> I'm finding it a bit difficult. If I'm gonna do something for 20 minutes a day, I wanna be getting better at it. I kind of wanted to throw some lessons in the mix. Inner dancer inside. Inner dancer. Here she comes. If I identify how to be on B, you're still talking. You aren't dancing at all. Wow, you're just counting to eight? It's not super useful. Mm -hmm. We get to just talk to each other for a while. Yeah, we don't really get to do that that often. We don't because we hate each other. Mm hmm. Man, parenting really cramps my marriage style. <laughs> when she goes to bed, then it's like, hey, let's watch something or look at her phone. I like, I've talked to her all day long, and at that point, I don't want to talk to anybody. It was, it was great. It was really great. Ba dooby doop, ba dooby doop. Hop, hop for my love. Ba dooby doop, ba dooby doop. It's harder to dance for 20 minutes than to do 10,000 steps. Yeah, it is. Shall we dance? In some ways, this is like yoga for me in that I don't want to do it, mm -hmm. and then I do it, and then I just feel good. I was in a bad mood, and I was like, gotta f***ing dance. With my stupid husband. Gotta dance with my dumb old husband. And then we danced. It was great. It's so calming and relaxing. Or like meditation, but mm -hmm. with someone else. Mm -hmm. Play the greatest dance song of all time, Staying Alive. You should be dancing by Bee Gees. Sure. <laughs> Playing on YouTube. Okay, that's not it. Yes, for it. Where the young mother, where the young mother, you stay alive, stay alive. How is that behavior that has a mother, you stay alive? I don't feel like dancing first thing in the morning. I'm not having fun. Or at the end of the day. Yeah. This is, it's surprising. I thought I would, I thought this would be really fun and enjoyable. I don't mean to be negative about it, I just... I was feeling the same way, and yeah. I didn't want to be negative about it either. Yeah, middle of the day before lunch, maybe? Look at us, we're like, wow, we have to dance. I know, but, <laughs> but we have to dance. <laughs> It's fun <laughs> when it's fun. It's fun when it's fun. Otherwise, it's not fun. It's not as much fun when yeah. it's not fun. Hey, yeah. Boo, boo, boo. Hey, China, you want to dance? I have had a day. Well, we don't have to dance. Okay. <laughs> this hit that ice cold Michelle. Now how do you feel? 
better. Oh, do that spin again. <laughs> the night we met, I knew I needed you so. We're gonna fall in love and it feels alright, yeah. Hugging and a squeezing and a holding and a pleasing and a hooping and a doobing. You requested the Dirty Dancing soundtrack. Which... This is the most fun so far. <laughs> <laughs> so much. You were ready for sleep and then we played this soundtrack. Right. This is the longest we've danced. You were also exhausted yeah. and you were willing to keep going because I was still dancing. <laughs> I love you. I love you. Fine. Are we, are we gonna kiss right now? Oh my god. It's our first kiss. Are we gonna kiss? It's our first kiss. Are we gonna kiss? <gasps> Cut. Allie just asked me if I danced and the answer is no and I don't feel good about it. This is just a confessional. Just me being inadequate. <laughs> 20 minutes is a long time. But and it doesn't even have to be 20 minutes. I know. Here we go. Second half of the month is where it's at. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Craig. <laughs> I'm sorry, Craig. I'm Seriously, sorry. I'm very sorry you I'm have to edit sorry. this. I love you, pony, pu, pu, pony. Say I do. I love you, pony, pu, pu, pony. Say I do. It's against the law. It was against the law. Hold my mama saw. It's against the law. Did you have fun? Around the globe, 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 around the globe. I like that it looks like we have like a strange child behind us. <laughs> we call him Don. Don Risotto. Don Risotto. So dancing. Sorry, what? I've done a very bad job on this challenge. Missed at least a quarter to a third of days. When we're doing it, it feels fun it's like nice but uh, this one is not going to continue for sure no i want to dance less than i thought i did me too <laughs> <laughs> animals in the bed let's go let's go animals in the bed let's go animals in the bed let's go let's go animals in the bed let's go okay i'm eating it animals in the bed, animals in the bed let's go Hello. Hello. So, the month is over. Yes, it is. Well over. A couple weeks into October now. How do you feel? Good. Good. Good what talk. What was this video about? Good talk. I missed so many days. It was, it was almost like I wasn't trying, but I was. With walking, it was like, you start your day with a walk. It's part of your daily routine. You do not want to start your day dancing. There's zero part of you wants to roll out of bed and be like, I'm gonna listen to loud music and shake my body around. No, for real, how do you feel? I don't think it had a long-term impact on my life. No, because we haven't really danced since then. No, I'm kind of glad it's over. This is a weird thing to say, but it kind of highlights how low we are at certain parts of our day. Like we're just kind of out of steam. So we should make a major life change. That was the general reaction. <laughs> we tried a few times earlier in the day and it didn't really work when our kid was awake. After she's asleep, I just mm -hmm. want to put on pajamas and veg out. Okay, what were the things that were great about it? Um, I, I like to dance while I'm doing stuff. You know, one thing that we did that kind of worked is we would like dance while doing other things. Yes. Which was cheating a little bit. That was not allowed. It wasn't necessarily not allowed. It was not allowed. Oh. At the times I asked if we could just do that and you said no, that it wasn't allowed. You did. You did. You did. 
I thought of a really good thing. What's a good thing? You fell in love with the Pointer Sisters. That's a really good point. Yeah. Or sisters. Almost never wanted to do it every day. And I almost always felt really invigorated after we did it. It does loosen you up a little bit, made mm -hmm. me smile a little bit, made me have fun. Even knowing that I still don't want to do it. I don't know why, what's wrong with me? I feel the same way. I thought it would be like endorphin time, like I'm a new person. Mm -hmm. And it didn't have that effect on me. It takes a little getting into it before it starts to feel fun. Mm -hmm. And you're always stopping something else that you either want to be doing or need to be doing. It's the same thing with yoga or exercise or meditation. Mm -hmm. There's an initial barrier of discomfort. I feel like I should always be doing something productive or relaxing. None of this middle ground crap. I really enjoyed dancing by myself. Not that I didn't enjoy dancing with you. It was surprisingly awkward for two people who've been in a relationship for 13 years. As I edit this, I realize I should say that lately I will occasionally take breaks and do a little Dancing. And when you're by yourself, it feels really dumb, and you feel really stupid, and it makes you laugh, and it makes you feel good. I was surprised I, I wanted to dance less when I knew I had to dance, <laughs> making yeah. it a... A chore. Why do I feel like such a failure? I know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Craig, why did you do this well, to us? Well, okay. We were fine. Hey, I didn't make you do anything. Sometimes challenges... Well, actually, you work it out right here. You do challenges. Some of them work. Some of them you keep for, for life and some of them you don't, you know? Well, it was nice to see you every evening for a while. I mean, you still see me every evening. We live together and we're both home almost all the time. I, it was good to hang out. Nice knowing you. Nice knowing you. Yeah. <laughs> we should still dance from time to time. We'll dance from time to time. Not right now, though. I'm tired. And with that, we wish you well. Mm -hmm. See you next time on mm. Craig and China's Wonder World. Is that what the show is called? It's called Craig and China's Wonder World. Mm. Mm -hmm. yeah. Thanks for watching Craig and China's Wonder World, everybody. Now that I've edited this, my own reaction is that I think they had a harder time because I don't think they were slow dancing as much as we were, and they seemed to hold to the 20 minutes rule much more strictly than we did. Also, I kind of liked it and would gladly do it anytime China wants to. But yes, it, it can be a little intimidating and annoying to have to do it. I wish it were easier to motivate yourself to do things that you know will feel good eventually, but not at first. Maybe that's for another video. That is all. Thanks to Jack and Natalie for doing this and really genuinely pushing through even when it was challenging. Check out Pomplamoose and all their stuff linked down there. Now it's time to thank our sponsor. Let's cut to other footage of me thanking our sponsor. And now I'd like to take a moment to thank our sponsor, one dream. They put the E-um in your one dream because they take your dreams and they make them tastier because they give you the knowledge you need to achieve them. Anyway, they're the premier entertaining and educational video subscription service that enriches your overall life experiences with approachable, comprehensive, and illuminating content. It's a museum for your mind, an institution for your imagination, a mini-mart for your winning smarts. A playland for your brain glands. Anyway, you heard me talk about The Great Courses Plus. Well, now it's called Wonderium, but it has the same great content you've come to know and love and more. So don't go around calling it The Great Courses Plus anymore unless you want to seem like a time traveler from the past, or maybe you actually are a time traveler from the past. That'd be really cool. You can travel forward in time, get all the future knowledge you need from Wonderium, and travel back in time. Profit. But watch out for paradoxes, time police, and Biff Tannen. Unfortunately, I learned about how unlikely time travel is from Wonderium. Anywho, speaking of dancing, there's all sorts of courses on dancing. So it's it's more than just a museum for your mind, it's a louvre for your groovra. You know what I'm saying? I hate myself. They got short form videos, long form videos, how to's, tutorials, that's the same thing! Travelogues, documentaries. I found this course on screenwriting, which is fantastic, because I always love discussions about movies and the creations of them. And I have been researching screenwriting a lot lately because I'm thinking about writing a screenplay, which is just as cool as writing one. Also, I learned a new vocab word from this course. Anagnorussis, when a character has a tragic epiphany. Look at that $5 word, mind blown. If you'd like to gather that sweet, sweet now, you need well you've come to the right place actually no you just missed it the link is literally just inches below here wow you had to sit through this whole video to find out that you were so close you had an anagnorosis an an you're having an anagnorosis right now anyway to show your support for my channel you can subscribe to wonderium right now just go to wonderium.com slash wheezy waiter and sign up for a free trial today thank you and thanks for watching youtube thinks you like that video here's a playlist of all of our other challenges support me on patreon and subscribe
mother, you're my mother, whether you're my mother, you're staying alive, staying alive. I was never having a hand, so I'm having your staying alive. <laughs> Poor Craig. Seriously, sorry. I'm very sorry you I'm have to edit sorry. this.